An Arizona volleyball team traveling to Austin is mourning the loss of a teammate this morning. We're told three families got caught in severe weather and hit a patch of black ice near Junction, Texas Thursday evening. KXN's Caitlin Carmote spoke with the team's owner. The girls were supposed to play here at the Austin Convention Center along with more than 100 teams, many of them coming from out of state, then um, from Arizona, but they never made it. The competition is tense Saturday evening as the tournament plays on. Next to these players, a tragedy as teams from all over the U.S. pay tribute. They were nearly there. The Arizona volleyball so team's were, owner says up, when flights were canceled into Austin, there was a choice made to drive. At that point, uh, three of the families had uh, indicated that there would be driving. Their SUV carrying seven people were just a couple hours outside of Austin. When they lost control, hitting an 18-wheeler head-on. A TxDOT camera shows the road conditions early Thursday morning along Highway 377 where the crash happened that evening. We would, uh, if the road conditions were were already in, in, in any kind of danger, we would have said uh, no, uh, we would have canceled, pulled out. Uh, again, it's important for people to understand that, that we, we do do our due diligence in making sure the safety is always the priority in everything we do. After the accident, Venom pulled out of the tournament. There's now two athletes clinging on in critical conditions. One of the three parents is in the hospital, but in stable condition. Caitlin Carmoot, KXAN News. And KXAN checked in with the tournament at the convention center days before it started, knowing there would be a lot of travelers. The Austin Sports Center told us some teams scheduled to play Friday morning were moved to a later start date due to canceled flights. There is a GoFundMe set up for this team. As of this morning, it's raised over $100,000.